Hey there guys, I'm Danks564 and this continuous file let's play of Star Drive 2 as Chuck Affiliation and uh, yeah, we are doing okay I think. We are almost done with this little place but well we lost quite a few of our guys um, storming the lab that was supposedly that supposedly had some sort of a, I don't know. Oh yeah, sure, uh, forgot about that. We'll move these guys away. Uh, can you just go go into this place and uh, um, this fleet? I uh, guess it's going here to take up some more people. Yeah, let's launch as much as we can. And now we'll, I think this is the last planet of. Uh, Uh, of the hive, so we should be able to kill them quite easily. And CAC is done. You know what? Let's let's update our battleships a bit. We definitely don't need that. Uh, as much as fun as it is, as, as much fun as it is, I don't think it's all that useful. We'll plop the CAC instead. So it will actually be useful. So it provides 15 bon damage bonus to every ship in the fleet, which is v really quite useful. Plus, it reduces the fleet command point cost of the ship by 2, which will mean that the battleship will cost less than, uh, the, uh, than the cruiser, I think. Which is again pretty good. Okay, let's save it. And uh, just to make sure, uh, how many fleets do I have? This one has two battleships, one cruiser, two cruisers, and a couple corvettes. I think one of them is uh, assault cruiser, yes, and this one is Arctic cruiser, okay. And this is just corvette. Well, that's fine. I think we might b want to build a couple more battleships. Or maybe uh, cruisers with uh, with fighters. Or battleship with fighters. You know what? Let's build like a... Let's create super fighter battleship. Uh, super carrier, I know. How many fighter, fighter base can we fit in one battleship? Let's find out. Well, I guess that's good enough. Can we put some here? <laughs> well, technically it doesn't need to move, doesn't it? If we'll put, like, fighter base in here, we can just uh, plop some uh, basic engines here just for it to be able to move somewhat, but doesn't have to move at all, like, all that much. And, uh... Do we even want the basic command here? Because... 10% damage bonus to to equip chip. Mm. I don't know. Well, maybe. Why not? Maybe we'll put some some uh, weapons here. Definitely would be useful. What does main engineering provide? Okay, uh, don't think we'll need this. We might want to put a couple of shields. That's for sure. Mm, I don't think we'll need uh, CAC here, right? Because. Uh, We'll, we'll already have uh, quite a few CACs, uh, quite a few, yeah, at least a couple of CACs on the other ships, so that should be good enough. And uh, we'll put uh, fusion reactors in here. 
So, can we put big ones uh, somewhere? I uh, sure why not. Well, it's not. S there's no symmetry, so no, that's uh, it's good. Uh, yeah, well, all we need to do right now is just to finish up the the rest of the stuff. Um, let's put cruise missiles. Can we? No, they're too big. Oh, no, we can put some cruise missiles here. And, uh... Some... Ordnance? How much will it... Yeah, that's more than enough. And probably some point defense. Because mostly this ship will be just staying behind and all we need uh, is uh, for it to, you know, not get shot. It doesn't need to move. Like, fighters will do the most most of the job. Hopefully. Where's, where's laser weapons? Oh. So, point defense. I know, like, four here. Four here. And, uh... For here, we'll add a couple of more fusion reactors, and that should be enough, I think. Yeah, it, it's it's quite cheap. It's uh, it doesn't need to do anything else, so it'll just shoot. Oh, right. So these guys will shoot only sideways, which is not what we want. Uh, but if we extend the arc, they will be able to shoot forward as well. It's just, uh, yeah, that's good enough. I like it. Let's uh, save it as a carrier. Okay, and uh, build a couple of them, they will be our support ships. Uh, for example, where do we want to build them though? Ah, yeah, here would be good. We'll probably finish in like two of them in six turns. Mm. Made a rooster, I guess. Okay, mm. instead of this Chuck Rider. Why? Did we miss something? Oh, not enough ammo. For what? <laughs> Herb Cedar. Power capacitors, only a couple of those. Yep, that's good enough. Um. Uh, where is it? Build me a couple of those. That should be good. And then I think after we'll capture this plane, we'll focus on uh, uh, going through this rift. We'll see what there is. Uh, well, this little thing... I don't know. We'll send you somewhere eventually. Oh, right. What I want to do is to build a machine factory. A automated factory. Mech factory, yeah. Here. So now we'll have Max. And where is that second belt? And we'll build a Mac factory here as well. Yep, that will be good. Okay. What do we need to research next? Deep core mine? Maybe 
not that we need all that much production right now. Mm. Precious metal mines might be useful. More money is always nice. Though we're not spending them all that much, right? So who cares? Mm. Deep core mines would be really useful in our asteroid plants because they don't produce any food, like at all. So no minuses there, only bonuses plus five production per worker. It's actually pretty huge. And here, mm, I don't know. Transporter device. Ah, sure, why not? No, uh, you know what? No. Build food replicator, why not? We'll, we'll see. It's not very useful, but yeah, who cares? I uh, will just not build it. Trilox, spying on me. Okay, towards now our core wall. I'm good with that. It's here, right? Yep, here it is. And trade agreement with Drylox has expired. Can we renew it? Uh, let's see. I think so. Yep, now we are actually producing some money. Are we having trade deal with them? Uh, yeah. We're trading with as well. These guys, do we trade with them? I don't think so. So why don't we... Well, if we'll pay you a bit... Oh, uh, he's already... A... Yeah, sure. See ya. And now we're doing... We're in positive money, which is great. I like that. Um, do we want to fight it? Probably not. No, we'll not resolve it. I don't care if we lose anything. Our bill of shipyards, yeah, it's somewhat useful, but not really. Did we destroy... Yep, up there is high have fallen, there are people conquered or killed. Great. Um, so, uh, we'll land the fleet, I mean, uh, we'll land the troops, what's left of them, I guess, <laughs> be done with that. What do we have here? This one is actually not that bad of a production place, right? Uh, so that's fine. And why don't you build me something? I don't know, see no mine. Uh, build that, and then we'll see. It'll take some time for you to build it anyway. Okay, in the fleet. I don't think we need uh, corvettes. We'll just take uh, bell ships, while corvettes will. Uh, We'll unite into one group, let them be here, just as the distraction, I guess, I know. And we'll send you guys... This is building carriers, right? We'll eventually send you there. For now, you'll go to the refueling station and from there to here. And then we'll get to the this pink wormhole. Pollution sequence for where? Hmm, not bad. Do we produce any money? Not really. No. Hmm. You know what? Just build me a trade good. I don't actually care about that. Well, all that much so.
Oh, a mech. Can we upgrade it somehow? Yes, we can, like pretty much everybody else. That's great. Yeah. Laser rifle. And, uh... Power threads. For more actions. And, uh, probably... Yeah, why not combat knife? I like that. So, where is our... This, on one, still building? You know what, uh, let's rebase our leader here to... to one. When he'll arrive, we'll grab a couple of... Uh, Max and we'll send him here to complete his mission. Damn it. Oh, he's returning back, so that's okay. Mac factory is done. So only one Mac here, okay. But why does it count as two? I don't know. Maybe Max count as two? What do you want to uh, to build out? He's here. Something? No? Mostly it's here we don't have any like human workers or life workers that are all inorganic so we, I don't think we need to build uh, urban infrastructure since it will not affect us in any way shape or form. So just trade goods. That's fine. Okay. If we declare war on polyps, they will give us money. But uh, if we will not, they will declare war on us. Some underground uh, well, warhawk camel, I guess. Um, I d I'm not really sure I want to war right now. Especially with polyps, because they had war sh uh, battleships already. And, um... Uh, what the hell? Yeah, sure, why not? Wasn't it Polyps who... Oh, no, it's, uh, was... These guys. Cordarazin Collective that had battleships, for sure. But Polyps can warp out right here. And, uh... Be quite a pain in the butt. Uh, we'll see. Okay. Sneakularity cannons. That's pretty interesting. Uh, and the Stargate? What does Stargate do? Well, it... once well, built on the planet, the planet or Stargate, Stargate networks, planets, and then Stargate networks may share food without use of or freighters. Since my travel between the plants that have Stargate instantaneously. Uh, can we transport troops through Stargates? Because if we can, that would be pretty useful. A simply traveling citizens and food is not that useful? I don't know. Well, Singularity cannons sound, sound fun. This weapon creates a pinprick tears in the fabric of space and time and Hyper accelerates them towards the target. Projectile cannot be stopped by anything. It's a miniature black hole rather than a packet of energy. That sounds like fun. Let's uh, just increase passively damage to rockets and missiles and all that stuff for now, we'll see. Uh, we'll return to that in a bit. What can we do after that, I wonder? Phasers? That's fun. Okay. Damn it! did they intercept my hero? 
Yes, they did. Hopefully he'll be able to warp out in time. This is... It would be very unpleasant if they would kill him. Uh, well, let's begin the battle. And let's return. retreat. These guys are actually quite fast. I don't know if he'll make it. Hopefully he has shields, so I'm hoping he'll make it. And they're not that fast, actually. Is this one damaged for some reason? Or no, it's just a different type of frigate. Yep, we made it. Hopefully they will go into their wormhole and it will not bother us. Well, we'll be able to, you know, move somewhere like here. Oh, uh, sure, why not? Let's... It's only to maintenance, so who cares? And let's send the scout to... To scout on the polyps. Just go inside the wormhole and be close to there. Supercomputer is done. For duplicate, eh. We don't need that. You know what, just build me production. Uh, I mean money. That should be good enough, I guess. Are we building everywhere? No, this boat doesn't produce anything. Uh, build me money. And we have two carriers here, right? Right. So you go here and join that carrier fleet. Damn it, that wormhole disappeared. Ooh. <laughs> space bears are going through our space. And they are planning to colonize something? Really? That's a bit, you know, rude. What's this? It's a Drylox. They're going... To... Sneaky bastards. Oh, and this... Uh... Well, uh, the zombie planet is pretty much still zombie planet. It it wasn't uh, rebuilt or you know died out. They're simply hello density is done. Okay, and we have some sort of a fleet here. Well, it's a frigate of some sort. So oh no, there's there's actually quite a few ships here. So that that's good to know, I guess. Mm. Uh, what the hell? Let's research. Uh, you know what? Let's research singularity cannons, because they definitely, definitely sound like fun. We need to disable uh, dry locks at some point soon, because they're pretty big. And uh, yeah, okay, that should be good enough. Ooh. You sneaky bastards. Okay, change of plans. We'll go into attack them. Those uh, polyps have appeared in our space, so I guess we'll have to move closer and engage them. Oh, this guy. Yep, yeah, you go somewhere here. Uh, we'll get back to you. Are they going towards this planet? Yep, looks like it. Our fleet definitely will not be able to stop them, but... We actually have uh, some forces here. So they might stop them, I don't know. Hopefully. Well, that's not very likely. But who knows. You know... Like, laser rifle, bone weave, uh, or, you know... Threads and uh, Mad Kid. Why old Millie? 
scrap fusion carabine and uh, threads and med kit and uh, laser rifle. Mad kit and uh, threads, why not? Uh, you will grab combat knife, gloves, and charge. Where's charge? Here it is. And you will do the same, I guess. Combat knife, power gloves, and charge. I guess that's good enough. How many transport do they have? Two? So that's up to eight people. I think we can take them. They have 48 fighters. Oh, good to know. Can we make peace with them, I wonder? Uh, no. Okay. Um, you know what, guys? I think I'll make a cut here and we'll continue in the next episode. Polops leave me no choice but to conquer them. We wanted peace, but they didn't agree with us. <laughs> That's their problem. Okay, yes, thank you for watching. Goodbye.